안녕하세요 여러분 저희는 몽고봉입니다 <laughs> Hi guys welcome back to my channel Today we will be doing a Korean haul I know I go to Korea way too much way too often but you guys know how much I love Korea It is literally like cosmetics beauty heaven so if you go to Korea just don't let anything hold you back. Today it's a haul. I'm gonna show you guys everything that I bought from my latest trip to Seoul. First, I'm just gonna get the biggest things out of the way. Moistful Collagen Facial Mist from Etude House. I have been an avid fan of this for many many years. Very very hydrating. So if you have very dry skin, you would love this facial mist. The only downside is that quite highly scented. So I try not to put it on areas where I have irritated skin like my neck. If you want like a little pick me up, throughout the day I love it on airplanes when the air is really really dry I just spray it like in the air so that the air that I'm breathing is actually a lot more moisturized and it actually really works I know I sound a bit crazy I actually went with Korea Tourism Organization so they actually arranged a lot of things that were quite interesting a lot of activities and one of the highlights being my own two-tone lip bar at the Laniche flagship store in Myeongdong I actually customized my very own two-tone lip bar if you really want to just mix and match and create like two completely different colors and not go according to the combinations that they recommend you also can at the two-tone lip bar at Myeongdong but do note that reservations are required please make your reservations before you go down I created mine and it's actually really interesting because looking from the tube itself I wouldn't even pry these colors out of my hands because they look so normal and like really really weird but when I put it on it really really complemented my skin tone I thought it was really cool because the entire experience was just one of a kind and on top of that you can also engrave your name on top of it so you can choose between like English letters and Korean letters I actually went to Google like my Chinese name which is Meng Jin put it into Google translation and it came up this word called kumkunun which means dreaming. Everyone thinks it's nice so I was like okay that's just my self-proclaimed Korean name from now on. You can call me dreaming. <laughs> it's very precious I don't really want to use it and I still keep it in this box that it comes in. I replenished my Aritam Satin Lip Pencil Lip Lacquer. This time I got it in three different shades. Number one, number three as well as number six. I bought the number one like really long ago last year. I finished it. It's amazing that I actually finished like a lipstick. Decided to pick this up because you can't really get them in Singapore. Also replenished my Etude House Color My Brows in the shade number five. Cause it's much cheaper in Korea. Double the price in Singapore. I also bought the Jewel Light waterproof eyeliner from Holika Holika have really really nice colors the formulation is really good very creamy very buttery very pigmented it lasts really long as well so I bought these two also from Holika Holika I bought the magic inside what I think it's called magic inside <laughs> I have no idea but it looks like this eyeshadow and I love it because it is so glittery I'm very sure you can see even though the camera is pretty far away from me it is so glittery and I love it because one of you guys actually told me to go check this out because you said it was the dupe for the Stila Glitter Metallic Eyeshadow and you are really really right no regrets buying this glitter is just out of this world like once you pop it on your lids right people can see that glitter from like 10 meters away, really, no joke. This was about 10 sing dollars. Stila one is about like 30, 40 dollars for one. From Innisfree, I bought this thing called Real Hair Makeup Jelly Concealer. To be honest, this was just an impulse buy. I was waiting for my friend to shop. When in Korea, you just kind of feel like you need to buy something from every shop. <laughs> Basically, nowadays they are super in on like, you know, concealing your bald spot, your hairline so that you can make your hair look fuller. This is actually a cushion form, jelly texture, it has a puff, it has a mirror, and it's pretty small and handy to bring around. Quite like it so far. On the trip, I also got to make my own perfume from scratch. So I managed to smell like 30 different scents and put together my own customized perfume and it's so nice like I chose this bottle for myself also because it reminded me I can't remember of what 
perfume brand it was. I love my scents to be very florally and fruity at the same time and I'm very very blessed and very lucky to be able to just get my hands on it like you know just really try and mix and match the different concentrations of the ingredients that I want. This is what I created and I super love it. It's so precious to me because there's only one bottle in the world and I don't want to use it. <laughs> When you go to Korea, you definitely have to buy a lot of face masks. I didn't go crazy with it this time I have a lot at home and also because I've been to Korea so 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 many times and I've tried so many sheet masks, I am very sure I know what are the ones that work for me. Usually I just tend to go straight for those and I don't really like trial and error any other brands anymore. I love the Mamond Skin Fit Mask. Use them in Singapore but in Singapore it's slightly more expensive and in Korea you actually can get hold of a lot of sales. So when I bought this, it was one for one. Basically, it is half price of Singapore. And I bought the Camilla Anti-Aging one as well as the Hibiscus Deep Moisturizing one. Super love it. They are very, very good, very effective, good for sensitive skin, good for dry skin. One of my favorite Korean mask companies is also MediHeal. So we actually have MediHeal in Singapore, but of course, if you go to Korea, it's also cheaper and a lot of sales going on, a lot of one for one sales going on. So I would highly recommend you guys to go to Korea to buy. I bought the NMF Aquarium Ampule Mask EX. This is for dry skin. This is a collagen impact essential mask, firming and for more of anti-aging and all around like wellness. Here I have Aritam Idol Lash and I bought these lashes, three pairs for about 8,900 won, $10-11. I love it because it's very, very natural and it's not too expensive as well. Normal wispy ones that um, have a very thin bend, so it doesn't really look too obvious that you're wearing falsies. It blends very, very well into your makeup and your natural lashes. Actually, I think that is all. Probably one of the lamest Korean hauls you've ever watched. <laughs> I'm super happy and I'm actually going back to Korea again in November. Maybe you guys guys can look out for another haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, don't forget to subscribe, like and share and talk to me in the comments. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!